What is up, guys, and welcome to week five of the NBL. I am Team I'm joined by Joshua Lorsi. Yo, what's up, guys? What's going on? Your boy Lorsi here, back again once again. Yeah, this week we're playing Team Crumpet. This is Luke, uh, Game Boy Luke and Patters, so uh, two titans of the Pokemon YouTube community. And uh, two players have been uh, doing pretty well in draft leagues lately. I know Luke has been doing a lot better. Uh, what did I not bring? They have... Uh, Double Intimate is so good here. Yeah, that left side gets trampled by Double Intimate. That's really good. They put uh, all the physical attackers on one side and all the special attackers on the other side. <laughs> uh, we're still leading um, Shaman and yeah. Toracat, and you're bringing Kiram and Zapdos. I'm bringing Crocodile and Metagross. I just want to write down everything. Uh, uh, I'm going to lead King him. Was that? Yeah. yeah. I'm leading Tori. Tori. Yeah. But, um. Yeah, guys. This is week five, right? No, four? Five? Five. Oh, five, yeah. So that means we are tied 2-2. Two, two. Alright, I wrote down the things we know what they have. What did they not bring? They did not bring Vivalon, which is really good. Okay, I didn't realize that. Uh, that means they can't set up Tailwind, which is really nice. Um, what else did they not bring? They brought, didn't bring something else, but that's like the, that's like one of the more important ones. Oh yeah, we we have the new name, though. The new Shaman name. <laughs> Oh yeah, 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 yeah! I just, I just seen it. Oh, oh! But um, okay. ooh. this is a pretty simple turn one for us. We fake out the, the Manetric and we go for Z Celebrate. I hope he doesn't. What does does is Figures Beetle? Is he uh ground? Is he ground? Um, is... no matter what, the Diggersby shouldn't be able to KO the the Shaman because we're gonna have the unless it's Scarf, no. it's gonna be slower than this, right? No, no, no. What not it just like? Ground DMZ, the, uh... Torcat? I'm, I'm gonna focus yeah. Sash, so... Oh, yeah, 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 okay, we're good. Yeah, this is a, yeah, fake out, and, yeah. Alright, I'm going for the Celebrate, you go for the thing, the fake out. This sets up a, either an Earth Power or an Energy Ball next turn. Uh, we were gonna run Seed Flare, but, uh, Energy Ball allows us to, like, not miss, and I thought that was better. <laughs> We, we, we've seen what missing does so far this season. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're pretty happy with this lead. Like, this is probably the best yeah. thing that we could have seen them lead. Um, yeah, I was scared of Mawile, but... Yeah, like, once we get the boost up, it's a lot easier to handle. Um, mm -hmm. Mawile, Manetric would have been hard, because we want to overheat the Mawile, but we also want to, like, fake out the Manetric, so. This is, like, really easy, because now we put pressure on both the Diggersby and the Manetric on turn two. Like, there's no way that the Diggersby can, like, knock out the Shaman this turn, and probably not next turn either. Alright, so they stayed in their Mega... Okay, we stay down, which is... Oh, I like their diggers me name. <laughs> yeah, hit <laughs> him below it. Oh. Okay. Alright, good, 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 good. We got the Z celebrate off. Alright, big boosts. Big present. Congratulations, team man. You I did, did it. it! I did it! <laughs> oh, but they, they oh. Life orb, yeah. <laughs> Alright, um. Uh, let me do Torakat Calx against the Diggersby. Diggersby against Torakat. I want to see how much overheat does. Mm, I don't think it hails from that range. Maybe. I, I'm, I'm in my. Um. 
do like 67. Wow, um, you're so good. It's 60 to 70. <laughs> um, I think that we go for... I want to think... The, what? The diggers be right? But, I mean, extra probably has overheat. Does it? Yeah, because we're Metagross. So, I think we yeah. KO the, the Manetric if we can. And... Um, U-turn? Yeah. You turn off okay. of the, the thing into the Zapdos, probably. Okay. That's what I'm doing. Alright. That is what I'm doing. Oh, Earth Power the Metric. Yeah, we have Synthesis on the Shaman, so we can start boosting up. We can get Toracat back in and get another Intimidate down on the Digger Speed, go for Synthesis, that kind of stuff. Yeah. It should, should, should be fine. As long as... Diggers be doesn't crit, no. Don't say that. Ugh, I'm sorry. Um. No, that's fine. Do you want to go into Kerem instead? I'm going to Kerem. Yeah. Going to Kerem, so we can get the double knockout. To secure. To secure the bag with, um... They're smart. The only thing I don't like about going Kiram here is that means if Gothitelle comes in, that they could potentially go for a... Don't crit. Don't, don't, don't say those words! That's how you get crit! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I apologize. Uh, what Never. do they have in the back, potentially? It's, uh, Minetric, Goth, Serp, or Shandy. I think we can go for... Earth Power... Do you think they switch out? What do you want to go for? I want to go for Synthesis. And Ice oh, Beam. Well. They switch out here, right? Almost always. You said you want to go for Earth Power? I want to go for Synthesis. Okay. And I go for Earth Power? You go for... I want you to go for Ice Beam into Digger Speed. Do you not think the Manetric switches out here? Um... Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Ice Beam, yep. Mm -hmm. And I'll synthesis. Right. Okay. Forgot that super effective damage towards the. Well. Yeah, you should pick up the knockout on. Nah, I was thing. scared. I was scared that they would double into the uh, shaman, right? But I forgot that cube is faster than chaos. Yeah, and I'm not afraid of them going for a Snarl here, because if anything, they'd be trying to pick up... If they don't switch out, they're trying to pick up Knockout on Shaman. Mm. Gotcha. The only thing I we love do... the Shaman name, question. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The only thing we don't want to see here is Goth. That's Locke, that's Goth. Um, that's fine, though. Uh, that's fine. Hit him below, withdrew into... What's that? Ooh. Okay, that's good ship damage though. So. Alright, we need to do some calcs. Goth. Against Torque. Uh, no, against Shaman and Cube. I want to see if this thing can live. Or if this can, can go down, rather. 96. Oh, uh, with a, um, a double? Yeah. Energy ball at plus one is doing, like, not enough. It's only doing, like, 35, 40. Um. Let's think. The... Kiram is going to be doing, like, Ice Beam is going to do roughly 30 to 40 again. Mm -hmm. uh, Z Earth Power would be doing around the same. Um, so what do we want to do? So you want to do Z Earth Power? You want to double? Uh, it's not going to KO Goth. It's not going to even be close. Really? Wow. Um, well, thingy protects here, right? The obvious play would be protect trick room, right? Yeah. So how do you want to counteract that? I think we still, like, 
target it down with fusion bolts just in case. Okay. And maybe throw an energy ball into the goth starter trying to get some chip yeah chip damage on it. Okay. That's what I'm doing. Fusion bolt. Okay. Yeah, like they had to go for that, I think. Mm -hmm. And this is probably mm -hmm. a trick room. Mm hmm. Oh, oh wow. Uh we I don't think we would have picked up the knockout regardless. Thunder wave. Thunder. That's fine. They're not trick room. What? <laughs> That's wild. Yeah. Um You know I want you to I ground EMC the upset. You know I want you to ground EMC the 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 Gyarados, right? Do I do I ground EMC? Uh their potential switches are Oh no, it would be Digger Speed, wouldn't it? So maybe Ice what Beam. Like, uh, to take a Fusion Bolt. What takes a Fusion Bolt? It's, it's Digger Speed. So Ice Beam. I Ice Beam that slot. Yeah. But I, I was scared that they might go. In. What's, on, what's on that slot? Oh my god, I hit. I'm it's a, it's um, Pangoro, Digger Speed, Mawile, Gyarados. Oh yeah, I thought they would switch Mawile in. Do you think that. Um, I already I already clicked Ice Beam though, but okay. I was I was thinking of Mawal coming in. Okay. But you Seed Flare again, so yeah, I'm just gonna uh, Energy Ball the 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 so that, If if Mawal does come in, then um, we just switch to our cat or something. We also just have like you know Z Ground. And I think you're still faster than the Gyarados, the... probably yeah. Yeah, I just hope that's not like flying or some shit. That would be really annoying. I also think that would be a kind of weird set to run against a lot of our Pokemon. Like, it doesn't hit Zapdos or Metagross, which are like more of the problematic Pokemon. Okay, I stayed in. That's fine, I think. Um, hopefully this knocks out. Nice. Yeah, okay, good. Don't fly, Z. Do they fly Z? No. Oh, that's a Z happy hour. Okay. Um, I think. Let's see how celebrate. Yeah. Dude, the double Z celebrate. <laughs> oh lord, this is getting a little. Uh, um. I mean, we still have fusion bolt though. Uh, Gyarados yeah. does not get baton pass, right? I don't think so. It does. Gyarados? No. I, 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 I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna look it up to be sure. I'm, I'm yeah. fairly certain it doesn't get Baton Pass. Uh, no, it doesn't. I don't think so. No, oh, no. it does not. Oh. Okay, so it's it's heavily chipped. Oh, we man. have Intimidate if we need to, like, shut it down. Yeah. That is true, but, um... They can't... They can't touch the Shaman. Like, yeah, no, uh, Ice Fang is, like, their best move, probably, to touch it, unless they're running just, like, no, uh, like, just, like, raw bounce. <laughs> and we, and we do have the potential, uh, freeze chance, too, so. I mean, we just fusion oh. bolt it, like. Yeah, true, true. Like, it's already heavily chipped, that's the big thing. It's, like, if it wasn't chipped, then it would be a little bit, uh, concerning, but, like, it's going mm -hmm. down from a fusion bolt. Swinging is... Oh, right, that. Okay. So, am I grounding that? Get it. I'm grounding. <laughs> <laughs> I think you just go for Fusion Bolt, and I go for Earth Power. Okay. Uh, hold on. Did you lock it? Nope. Um, do we care about, like, Protect Heat Wave? Um, Kieran B against Potentially. Plus one Gyarados going for Stone Edge. What does that do? We will live a Stone Edge, so. Oh, we should outspeed the Chandler too. Let me let me double check the Chandler account against Shaman. So what do you? Uh, two seconds. Uh, Shaman, Shandy. Uh, Earth power at plus one against Shandy from our Shaman. Uh, can pick up a knockout on no bulk. Do you think the Gyarados protects here? 
to be honest, I don't know after that last play. After uh, that last turn, I don't know. I don't know. Can't really tell. But uh, what do you want to do? I kind of want to fusion bolts the Gyarados and Earth Power with Shaman. Okay. That's safe. We'll just do that. Okay. Oh, we are the overheat. Oh. They're still slower? What? Oh. How is. Uh, what? No. That's a Scar Shandy. Uh, yeah, it is. Because we outspeed max speed. Uh, okay. We got the low roll. Or, yeah. That's fine, though. Um. Mm -hmm. Overheat was gonna do like. Um, probably 80%. And they would have had plus, like, minus two Shandy on the field. True, true. So, like, it wouldn't have been the end of the world, but obviously that's nice. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, we dodge overheats like it's our job. Shout out to your cart. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't think we've... Uh, has an overheat lantern on us once this season? <laughs> I don't think so, and I think team <laughs> that are pre are putting overheat, you guys have to like second guess. That. It's just just, not just run flamethrower. <laughs> oh man, yeah. they never learn. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Gyarados side has Mawile Diggersby left. Uh, I'm assuming it's Mawile and not Pangoro. And mm. the Shandy side has Shandy Main left. We know that for a fact. That's getting ground seed to death. <laughs> yeah. Um... Bye bye. Then I'm clicking Earth Power on Shandy. Like, that's yeah. simple, straightforward. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let me double check the Shandy roll. So I'm actually kind of curious. 100... I sent you the paste, right? What? How much is bulk is on our shaman? Sixteen. Uh. All right. So we're actually in KO range with shaman. So that actually kind of mattered a little bit. It's just that it's uh. It's, they would have given us the free switch, the minus, they would have been... Oh, right, minus. yeah, no, like, uh, the big thing is that they could still knock us out here. Um... Uh, oh, <laughs> my gosh! No! <laughs> Your cart? Oh, my <laughs> God! This cart is ridiculous. I, I think they're 0 for 3 against us with overheats now. <laughs> no. Um, what do I have in the back, anyways? I've, you have Crooky and um. I have Crook and I have Meta. Yeah, like. <laughs> That's just uh, not this... fair. That's just not fair. <laughs> uh, I think that Overheat should just be banned. Just ban it. Ban it. Yeah, the the roll is like 302 on min and 356 at max with the 333 roll being in the very very high end of it. It's probably mm. like it was probably like a 75% chance to KO. Gotcha. Oh, what do we do here? Um Are you seed flying? Um thing. And I earth power the mini, mini tree. Well, my earth power kills the, um, the manetric. Yours doesn't though. So I'll earth okay. power the manetric, and you should ice beam the diggers be. 
Sound good? Yeah, I'll just lock them. Okay. They oh. hit one! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and that doesn't knock out because bulk. Yeah, the overheat misses definitely sa saved us like one or two. Uh... Yeah, that's wrong. <laughs> okay. I think you probably should switch for like differential, right? Yes. That's some F I. Yeah, this should be, yeah, Snarl, safe play from them. Yeah, that was the thing I was most afraid about, a Snarl Manetric. That's what we had to figure out on turn one. If they got Snarl off on Shaman, we don't get to do, like, any of the fun things. We mm -hmm. don't like to a KO Goth. Wow. Click on the Earth Power again. Overheat, go! Yeah, like, good games to them. The overheat misses definitely saved us probably one to two mons in potential. Or in potential. Or, mm -hmm. no, D differential. My god, words are so hard. Um, mm -hmm. Because we had Metagross and uh, Crookedile in the back, and they could have, like, kept firing off fire attacks into that slot. Like, we eventually win anyways, I'm fairly certain, but we probably lose, like, three mons in the process. Yeah. The the big thing is that um No we gotta save the battle. The big thing is that we had the uh the shaman to a KO the goth. As soon as that happened I knew we were in a pretty good spot. Um but yeah, we have um G and Beatdown next next week, so uh that should be pretty fun. They're always uh uh really fun to play. G's like a guy I've gotten to see a few times at events now and he's really funny, so I'm looking forward to it. He's a he's a cool dude. Uh, anything else you want to say about this match, Josh? <laughs> uh, overheat. Don't. <laughs> just, just <It's>, don't. <laughs> overheat is uh, sus. It's a sus move. Sus, very sus. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, Team Builder uh, was on Josh's channel this week. Gonna be on my channel next week. Uh, Battle is on Josh's channel next week. Something yeah. like that. Uh, like yeah, we'll figure it out. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> Peace. Bye.